I'm interested in kind of handmade and handmade mistakes. You know, people that used to design fonts and they'd draw them out on each letter on an A4 or an A3 sheet of paper. I do that in a modern way with stencils and spray paint in ways that didn't exist when they were created. Certain fonts, certain letters look, certain letters work better than other letters. So if you were going to write a word, you would try to choose a font where all the letters in that word looked cool. I did graffiti for years and years, loads, and I was like, you know, at certain times the most prolific, the most up graffiti writer in London, and you know, painted loads of trains and take loads of stuff. But outside of that graffiti world, no one had ever really heard of me. And we did it for ourselves and you know, our mates, and because we liked getting away with it. When street art began to happen, I got kind of a, re a reputation for being a street artist. On the back of that, people who had an interest in street art, which were different to people who had an interest in graffiti, kind of wanted to buy into it and wanted to buy screen prints and canvases and, you know, gradually and slowly selling them. To do something like this, you've got to generate press and it's like, you know, it's expected that I talk to that person and talk to that person. And if I do those things, then I'm a good artist to work with and people want to work with you again. And if you just fuck everything off and act like a moody arsehole artist, then people don't want to work with you again. Yeah, last night I would have just liked to have been invisible rather than not recognised. Did they give you permission to scrap the wall? But then times like, you know, we painted the wall today and that bloke turns up and I used to go to his club 20 years ago and his kids are here and, you know, that kind of shit's nice. So... We got married in June. Instead of getting loads of crap toasters and, and chef mixes and all that rubbish we just said everybody chip in for a piece of artwork for a wedding present and we bought one of Ben's we've got a one of one of one of Ben's world record attempts the A to Z prints they were riverboat police they weren't even like Met Police or City Police because City Police are bastards Met Police are alright you can chat to them but I've never met the river police before. So once they'd kind of sorted it out that we had permission, they were kind of, you know, should you get paid for this? Is this your job? Is this what you do? Did you go to college? I see you've got tattoos. Do you also do tattooing? <laughs> This part of the East End, the whole of the East End. That is works in America now, isn't it? The president's got a piece of his work, so... No, I feel well known. But, uh, yeah, maybe one day, famous. I don't know, is Banksy famous? I'd like my work to be famous.